Okay, we are about to leave the Market District of Denerum and find our way to Earl of Denerum's estate. We're actually there. Yeah, Earl of Denerum's estate, because that's where we got to go, because, well, the queen's been kidnapped. And, you know, whenever a queen's been kidnapped, we got to go save her. Now, the queen may actually be very important for our potential power struggle against Turn Logan. If we can get her on our side, we could potentially find ourselves in a better position when shit starts to go down. Uh, we are definitely going to get jumped. Let's just move on. Of course, I gotta check the uh, gotta check the chests and stuff. Open. Do not want that. Is no one gonna attack me? Trap right ahead. <sighs> Trap and so right here ahead. is the mighty Grey Warden at long last. The crows send their greetings once again. And where is Zevran? I don't see him with you. How very disappointing. Severin? Zevran who? <laughs> Don't bother. I know very well he travels with you. Here I am, Talisan. Tell me, were you sent, or did you volunteer for the job? Oh ho! And he makes an appearance. I volunteered, of course. When I heard that the great Zevran had gone rogue, I simply had to see it for myself. Is that so? Well, here I am, in the flesh. You can return with me, Zevran. I know why you did this, and I don't blame you. It's not too late. Come back, and we'll make up a story. Anyone can make a mistake. Of course, I need to be dead first. And I'm not about to let that happen. What? You've gone soft. I'm sorry, my old friend, but the answer is no. I'm not coming back. And you should have stayed in Antiva. Ah, okay. He's got to be in our group. Yes. Indeed. More enemies yeah! ahead. How about you? Time for killing. I will know that the first time I played in this game. Uh, uh, I did not have enough approval to get me to come to Dr. In fact, uh, I'm surprised that that character showed up. Surprisingly late in my game, and I didn't have time to get food off of them. And so when we got to this point, he betrayed me, and I had to kill him. The kind of thing that can really mess up like the continuity of these games, because you'd be able to import your save from game to game as you progress through, as opposed to simply starting each new sequel from scratch. Talisan is dead, and I am free of the crows. They will assume that I am dead along with Talisan. So long as I do not make my presence known to them, they will not seek me out. So what does this mean? I do not know. It seems I have options now, whereas once I had none. I have enjoyed our company, but I am wondering if it is not time for me to leave. That would be the practical thing to do, no? There is a freedom awaiting me that I have never known. But I suppose the decision is yours. Will you let me go? Don't you want to stay for the treasure? Mm, all right. You make a convincing argument. You do seem to stumble onto treasure on a regular basis somehow. Let us return to the task at hand, then. There is still much to be done, yes? Ah, got a couple of approval points. Anyway, I he uh, as the games you go from Dragon Age to Dragon Age Two to Dragon Age Three, it begun. it's hard for them to make an assumption that certain events would have occurred. For example, in Dragon Age well. Two, the character of Zevran could very well appear. Cool. But then again, Zevran could be dead. You could possibly have never recruited well. him. You could have killed him back when you first met him. You could have killed him at this point in the game. He could have gotten tired of you and left at some point. I've I'm not a talking question, to you. If I may. Ah, go ahead. Well, here's the thing. I swore an oath to serve you, yes? And I understand the quest you're on, and this is all very fine and well. My question pertains to what you intend to do with me once this business is over with. 
as a point of curiosity. Does your oath expire then? Not precisely. I said I would serve you until you saw fit to release me. One simply assumes that once your Grey Warden business is finished, you would have no need of an assassin to follow you about. Am I wrong? Uh, not at all. You can go if you wanted. Could I? And what if I didn't wish to leave? Uh, why wouldn't you go if you had the chance? How should I know? I cannot see the future. What if I liked it here? What if we became fond of each other? Hmm? Stranger things have happened. Could use a friend, perhaps. See, I have a tendency to grow on others. You'll see. It is good to know what my options might be, but that is for another time. For now, we have much to do, yes? That could also give you some difficulty with, as far as the game uh, progression goes, with like other characters, like Liliana. She could never have joined your group. Also, it's quite possible that she could have been killed by this point in the game, or by Dragon Age 2 or 3, uh, games which she has a presence in. So it put a lot of strain, I can imagine, on the developers of these games further on in to sort of make sure everything is, um, everything remains in continuity. Hello, elf lady I'm supposed to be working with. The servant's entrance is on the other side of the house. We must slip past this cloud to reach it. We will have to be very careful. Al how is inside. What are you doing here? You're obviously a lesion. How is here? Yes, and wherever he goes, the great many guards go with him. <sighs> What's the crowd gathered for? The estate is in poor repair. The new owl, he has not been very prompt in paying his workmen. I will be right behind you. This way. No, the carpenter's crafter all has had enough of house convenience. This way? Okay. Tell me this way, and I have to lead the way, so whatever. Creeping around down there. Go check it out. You can't see me, motherfucker. Oh, they're coming from the other direction. Tom for killing. Yes, yes, let's kill more and more Ferelden soldiers. Now I find it difficult to believe that Turn Logan is involved in this plot to have Anor potentially killed in order to uh, garner support for his own cause. She is his daughter. Now, he's a very... Let's call him pragmatic. He's a very pragmatic individual. But even he has his limits, I can imagine. You know, picking up everything again for no freaking reason. Ooh. This is an item that you would give to Shale if he were in my party. I can distract the gods, but you must move quickly. Why bother? There's only two of them. More guards patrol every hour. If they find these two missing, they will know... How you say... Something is amiss. Wait, we need to put on our disguises. Tori! My lady does not have much time. Are you all prepared? I will go distract the guards. Let's go. I will lure them into the courtyard. Wait in the bushes. Oh my god, this armor is so retarded. Okay, let's hide. Oh, you must come! I saw something! A better fountain! I think it was a dark spawn! Dark spawn? They will drag us all underground to be eaten! Should we call for help? Did you fall off a cart full of stupid? Call for help? So they can see us act like scared little girls because of some knife-eared wench. They will eat us all alive! Please, get help! If there is something out there and we don't sound the alarm, we'll look worse than scared. And dress these holy knickers. Fine, we'll check the courtyard, if it'll keep you from wetting yourself. But there's nothing there. Thank you. Oh, it was over here! Quickly!
idiot. <laughs> okay, let's go on. Ugh, it's tier 3 armor. And everybody's wearing it. Including Morgan, who shouldn't be wearing heavier armor. Well, that's steel armor, right? That's, uh... It's medium armor, is it? Uh, it's heavy armor. Although it doesn't have any uh, strength requirements, so she can wear it, but shouldn't be. Still wearing this crap. Ah, oh, it took me forever to be rid of those two. You must be careful now. The servants, they will not look closely at anyone in uniform. All guards are alike to a cook, no? But you should not draw attention to yourself. Most of the guards are new. They will not know you for a stranger at a glance. It is best you keep your distance from all of them and try to blend in. Where's Anora? She's in a guest room, off the main hall. Andra, stay guide us. This kitchen is a disgrace. How did the old R servants ever cook anything? No one ever said the Kendalls had any sense. It is begun. Stuff! Let's just take everything we see, because, you know, we're like that. Are you cooking over that fire? It's ridiculous. Oh, guards. Yes, ma'am. Just moving through. Apparently they carry their weapons to launch. Huh. Get away. Three nights in a row. For all we know, it's not uh. mutton. How's too cheap to buy it? Cook's probably roasting the elves that broke in here. You realize that doesn't help, right? Oh. And perhaps I shouldn't talk to anybody here. My fold. It's all working out rather the nicely. Of all the nations of the world made the yeah. That guy looks important. Before the light, words become the clashing of pebbles. <laughs> <on> the Has begun. Key required. Can't you get us yes, in? Yeah, I didn't think you could. But anyway. As you must say. Be cautious here. My lady's life depends upon it. Give her back to the skies? I'm through sneaking. For all our sakes, I hope you know what you are doing. We're under attack! I like how this guard obviously just stood there and watched us undress and go back into our regular armor. <laughs> you really? You were just hiding over there? It is begun. We must hurry. Open we must the frickin' door. Ugh. Perhaps need to find a key. Very well. This guy over here might have it. The clay warden is here, my lady. Thank the maker. I would greet you properly, but I'm afraid we've had a setback. What sort of setback? My host was not content with leaving me under heavy guard. He seals the door by magic. Great. Now what? We must get her out of there. Don't panic, Erlina. Find the mage who cast the spell. He'll most likely be at Hal's side. I doubt he'll just open the door for me. Well, if he didn't know you were here, he soon will. Fine. I'll be back soon. 
Thank you, Warden. My prayers go with you. Theron Howe will probably be in his rooms. They're at the end of the hall, on the left. Now, one of the reasons why I decided to play as a human noble is because of this storyline that this character has with Earl Howe. While Hal continues to be a character in all of the different storylines, the human noble was the only one where Hal plays a role in their origin story and gives your character, in if you play as a human noble, a more personal vested interest in taking him down. And that's the only reason why I really went with, well, one of two reasons why I went with a human um, noble. It is begun. Here. Look, you didn't say nothing. Wait, who are you? You're not on my watch. Call the watch. We've got an intruder. Ah, should have killed the girl before she could tell anyone. Very well. <laughs> What now? You're dead, fool. What was he doing? I anyway? do <laughs> Perhaps I could have a try at that. Yeah, give it a swing. Ah, you suck. That looks important. I should take that. Who goes there? Shit. I thank you for creating such distraction, stranger. I have been waiting days for the opportunity. Do you think you could... Alistair? Is that you? Who... Wait. I do know you. You were at my joining. He's one of us. A warden from Orlais. Jada, I think. Or was it Monsumar? I'm afraid I don't remember your name. Amri Orden, senior warden of Jada. But born and bred in Hyever. I'm glad to be home. Why weren't you killed in Ostagar? Because I wasn't there. I was sent from Orlais when we received no word from King Kaelin. The king had invited all the wardens of Orlais and their support troops to join him. Then nothing. How large a force did you bring with you? We had 200 wardens and two dozen divisions of cavalry. The first we heard of Logain's edict was when everyone was turned back at the border. That was when the rumor reached us that wardens were being blamed for the massacre. We finally decided it was safest to send someone alone to learn how best to fight the Blight and this regime simultaneously. As a native Ferelden, I volunteered to make the crossing. <laughs> but the art demon's nearly here. Will you... Will we have no help? The other Wardens won't risk their strength fighting Ferelden's civil war. If they spend themselves against Loghain, there is truly no hope. They recall accounts of the first blight, how many cities fell. If Ferelden is too foolish to save itself, at least, we'll be ready when the Archdemon leads its forces further. Besides, I hear you haven't been doing badly at raising an army yourself. But perhaps if the Edict can be lifted, I will send a message as soon as we are gone from this place. Are these your papers? Yes, these are my records. The names of the dead I could recognize at Ostagar. What I could find of Duncan's own recruitment records. Copies of the joining ritual I rescued from our Denerim vault. Those should never be seen by any outside eyes, but I trust in their encryption. The joining ritual? Can you induct other Grey Wardens? Would that I could, for Ferelden sorely needs them. 
But for the joining to work, the recruit needs not only fresh darkspawn blood, but a drop of blood preserved from an archdemon. For Elden's supply should have been in the vault, but it was gone. I can only imagine someone took it out and Loghain either confiscated or destroyed it. Then we need to get it back. As you know, the joining's chance of success is slim anyway. Loghain has done far worse to the Wardens than cut us off from recruiting. And from the rumors flying through Denerim, removing him from the throne is already your plan, no? Where's Hal? I saw him going to the dungeons. He may still be there. How did Earl Hal capture you? With an offer of hospitality and a poison chalice. I was fool enough to think Loghain didn't yet know who I was. Why don't you come with me? I wouldn't be much use to you in my current condition. And if you'll pardon me, I have a sudden desire to breathe some free air. I will seek you out later. After I find a good physician. And good luck, brother. We finally found another Grey Warden. Although he was, uh, let's say, indisposed for some time. Well, now that we've caught a little bit of information on where we can find how, I'll be ending the episode at the 21 minute and 35 second mark. <laughs>